This is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 7 and verse 19. Wisdom strengthens the wise more than ten mighty men which are in the city. Okay. First and foremost, I want to give our praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Bahakadash. Second, I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS that do rule well. Peace, love, hope, and salutations to the hopeful elect that scatter across the four corners of the earth. Where Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah has placed you at. Shalom to you, Akim, out there, in your life and your freedom. The preacher's gospel and his good news. Fair highways and byways, obey the internet. Shalom to you, Shalom to you, Israelites that may like the members of the the other nations but your bloodline goes back to abraham isaac and jacob and if your spirit can receive it you have israel like so shalom to you shalom to some say i go out there you free women you know and um you chosen as well okay today's lesson short lesson is just going to be based about knowledge you know and wisdom you know wisdom and, and knowledge because the times that we're coming uh, uh, upon just like if you read in verse 19 yeah you could be you know strengthened within numbers but real wisdom real strength you know real you know strength comes from you know wisdom okay wisdom strengthens the wise okay what makes the man wise wisdom okay wisdom strengthens the wise more than 10 mighty men which are in the city okay so the men of the lord are wise and they have the knowledge you know they have the knowledge and they're going to have the stability in the, in, in the times okay what times times of Jacob's trouble that we're approaching all right because yeah you can be mighty within you know have men thousands of thousands of thousands okay but I mean it doesn't mean that doesn't necessarily mean you have wisdom okay because wisdom goes a, a long way and we have been given the wisdom to give us the stability in the, in the times to come. That's why you have the elders and apostles that do rule well. And down all the other like-minded brothers that come in the name of Yahweh. Alright. Yahweh. By Hashem. Yahweh Shah. Okay. Yahweh is the name of the Heavenly Father who the world ignorantly calls God. Okay. By Hashem means in the name. Alright. And Yahweh Shah is the name of the only begotten son who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Okay, in these times to come, you wanna you're gonna wanna call upon your power, call upon the names of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah, because no other name under the heaven is gonna deliver you in such matter. All right. Before I end it, I'm gonna get Isaiah, one of my favorites, chapter thirty-three and verse six. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of those times. Okay, the times that we're coming across you can look outside and see what 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 times that we're in all right beginning of a of new year 2022 per se and it's already crime it's already things that's happening this year just begin it's just the beginning of this year and you already have things that's that's happening already what's going to get certain Akiyam through these times, certain individuals, what's going to keep them had that sense of stability? Okay, when you when you see the other, you know, men and women out here that didn't hearken, they losing their mind, they bugging out. You know, while everybody's bugging out and everything, losing their mind, you're going to have that stability because you hearken to the words of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Okay, and do that. Wisdom and knowledge should be the stability of our times and the strength of salvation. Okay, the fear, right? The fear of Yahweh. Okay, the Most High is His treasure. Okay, having that fear of Yahweh Bashem is going to get you through these times. He's going to be there for you. Okay, and at the end of the day, we all seek that's a part of this truth to be delivered by the Mashiach. We seek to see Yahweh Shah come and destroy this place, and and also to deliver the elect. And we already know that's going to happen because look how close we are to that chip being inserted. All right. Gradually. Everything is just happening in its own strategic time. But these prophecies are showing that each and every word, mark, print, anything, metaphor, anything in this Bible is absolutely true. The words of the Bible are 100% true. Accurate. Okay. So during these times, 
in these times that's coming upon the planet Earth, you know, us brothers, you true sisters, you true believers out there are going to have that stability, okay? We, we're going to have a different type of spirit upon us, right? We're not going to be like the individuals of this world that didn't want to hearken and didn't want to believe, all right? Because we're going to know what's up and we're seeing everything just plan out and it's a beautiful thing because that shows that every word that comes out the mouth of Yahweh is never a lie. Yahweh can't lie. He doesn't lie. All right? So if he says something is going to happen, it's going to happen. If he says he's going to have his men more pressured than fine gold, you know, not just any type of man, but a man that's a part of the truth, it's going to happen. If he says that he's going to send back his son, which is sitting on the right-hand side, which you truly believe to deliver the elect, the hopeful elect, it's going to happen. All right? If he says in that day, seven women should take hold of one man, a completion of women, it's going to happen. All right? Like you hear right here, and it says wisdom and knowledge should be the stability of those times. Correct. All right? So when all hell breaks loose, we're going to have that stable mindset. All right? It's easier than said, you know, than done, but, you know, I put all trust into Yahweh Bashem al And I pray that Yahweh Bashem al be with you, Akim, and your family during all these times that's going to come. You know, because through it all, he's still going to be there for us, and he's going to bless us and, and protect us. All right? Just give us that stable mind, man. That's a blessing in itself. All right? To not bug out and everything. Okay? So call Allah Yahweh Bashem al Call Allah Yahweh Bashem al Call Allah Yahweh Bashem al Bahashem Rakakadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS that do rule well. Peace, love, hope, and salutations to the hopeful elect that scattered across the four corners of the earth where Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah has placed you at. All right? Just know wisdom and knowledge, true wisdom and knowledge, the wisdom and the knowledge of this Bible, man, the scriptures, is going to be the stability of those times. All right? That being said, Shalom.